Oh shit, why am I telling this story? Guys, girls, girls even, yeah. If there's a girl watching this video, comment down below. You're probably gonna like this story, but this is bro talk. You might enjoy it too. But if you're a dude, listen, we gotta have a bro talk. I got caught a couple years ago. And for those of us that have... Every, every guy does it. Every, every guy does it. If you don't do it, you're a fucking liar. Girls do it too. But they're way more confidential about it. Now, not all of us have gotten caught. But for those of us have, that have, we have some stories to go along with it. And here is my unlucky story. But guys, before we start, please, 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 please comment down below and give me story ideas. I can't think of any. I know I have them. I just can't bring them up for the depths of my brain. Like, my, my brain just doesn't work when it comes to thinking of stories to do. Just so, just comment down below, refresh my memory, let me get some stories in. But guys, girls, ladies, gentlemen, this takes place when I was like 12 or 13. No, it was before, it was, I was probably 11 or 12. Now, I, I lost my virginity before this, which that's a whole other story. I don't know when I'm going to do that story. That's going to be a huge milestone, like 1K, 5K, 10K, something like that. That's a crazy story, and I'm definitely not telling that story anytime soon. But, so this takes place a while ago, and I'm chilling in my room, and I just got bored of using my hand. <laughs> oh, Lord, I was like, man, I got to think of something new. I got to get some ideas. I was a creative little kid, and I still am. But I just use my hand now. So, yeah. If you're sensitive to this kind of material, leave. Don't dislike, don't report, just leave. I mean, th that's all you have to do. Like, if you're getting cyberbullied, just shut off your computer. <laughs> that's it. So if you're uncomfortable with this, just leave. But for those of you thugs out there, you know what I'm saying, let's get into this story. So I'm thinking, I'm like, yo. And then next, you know, bing, and, the t and, the, and a little light bulb pops off my stupid little head back in the day and i was like oh my god no I, I was more like oh my god i could cut a hole in a pillow and i was like oh my god i'm gonna cut a hole in this pillow bro that's the best idea i ever came up with holy shit why did i think of this so i cut the hole in the pillow you know i i started to get the ritual going you know got got everything good laying that in my bed and whole time i was so into the i wasn't into it yet i didn't start i was so like I was so contrived to the idea. I was like, "Holy crap! Why did they, I didn't sh lock my fuck? I didn't lock my door, man. Lock your doors, guys. Lock your damn doors. No matter. How, and this was in my other room, in the back of the house. My sister has that room now, but it was in the back of the house. And I wasn't too worried about like, no, nobody comes down to this part of the town. And next thing you know, I'm just doing it. You know, I'm probably like five minutes in, just chilling, and I see a really quick motion to the left of me and I'm like and I'm like holy shit holy shit so I start freaking out I'm throwing shit I'm, I'm holding the pillow still and I have the blanket over me and the pillow is visible after one of the blankets and I'm just chilling there like lotion all over <laughs> like lotion all over the bottom section of me lotion on my hands and shit I'm just covered <laughs> oh shit this is the this is the best getting caught story but the worst for me in my opinion <laughs> so terrible terrible and next thing you know, I, see, I see that quick motion of somebody peeking their head and then peeking their head back out really quick. And I'm like, oh shit. So I freak out, you know, and then next thing you know, I hear steps walking back to my room. Like they were trying to make it look like, you know, they were just coming back there and they didn't just peek their head in. And I, I, I knew somebody peeked their head in. Like it was obvious. I saw, a, I saw a, a face. Let me just say that. And I was like, oh my God, that was my mom. That was my mom. That was my mom. I'm freaking out. You know how you would feel if you got caught too, guys girls and I was like oh shit next day my mom peeks her head in she's like hey what are you doing and I'm like nothing and I'm I'm like I'm like you know just looking at the pillow and this is the funny part I'm looking at the pillow just looking at the pillow I have it like like I'm holding on to someone like you know at a movie theater when you have your hand around somebody I have it I'm laying down like that and I have it like this and I was so stupid <laughs> I was, and she was like what are you doing I was like just just looking at it you know and why did I see this? Why? 
Why did I fucking say that? Why was I just why did I been like, you know, trying to sleep, you know what I'm saying? I said, just looking at the pillow, you know, just And then she's like, Alright, well, go to sleep. Never talked about it again as anybody would. Never talked about it again. It was never brought up, never nothing. It was so awkward and it, like you really just don't know awkward until you get caught, you know, jerking it by one of your family members or I wouldn't care if a friend caught me jerking it because it's like, oh, ha, ha, ha. Your dumb ass should have knocked first. <laughs> but no, if it's a family member, it's totally different. Way more awkward. <sighs> but guys, please drop a like for this video. This took everything out of me. I had to redo this video so many times. This is going to be my last time. But guys, please drop a like. Please give me suggestions so I don't have to do this. If you want to hear my losing virginity story, which is going to be the craziest video I ever upload, and it's going to... I'm probably going to have to get big before I tell that story because it's a really crazy story. Go ahead, drop a like, comment. Comment suggestions. And if you enjoyed this story, go ahead and check out my other life stories and subscribe. I'm going to create a life story playlist so you can watch all of them. But guys, the Vulture, see you later.